we are reflecting on a family life how adam and eve they hurt to the lord but the lord who was hurt his love for them is stronger than the hurts that they have heaped on him that's why the psalm says lord your life is greater than my life your love is greater than my life and i worship you in the beautiful psalm psalm 37 the psalmist says with evil people nor be envious of wrong to us wherever you go you will find variety of evil people on your journey there will be variety of things people who will be doing evil to you who will not acknowledge you who will not appreciate you who will not think of you who will rather try to find fault at you who will be trying to destroy you love our life is full of we are in the world take care that of the world doesn't catch you that's what the master said in john 16:33 he said in this world you will have all kinds of trials and tribulation but take care take care that the trials of this world do not capture you james chapter 4 the last sentence he said what is religion to care for the people to feed the hunger hungry but take care in the name of helping others you don't use them or abuse them let not the world contaminate you let the, let not the world capture you take care of yourself yes this world is the enemy is trying to pull down people when people are when you see evil when you see people hurting you when you see things are going around you this enemy is capable enough to keep you off a tree a plant is growing somebody cuts the plant but the root says no you can grow he has cut so the next day the stem is gone so what next day from the side a small small leaf comes out yes but the mankind or the people they are hurt they are wounded and the enemy is capable enough to capture them and they are gone to their bed oh i trusted my son he has cheated me oh my wife told me i will stand with him and she did not stand by me oh they have said this and they were doing something else wrong i trusted wrong people oh immediately depression a group of people the enemy leads them into depression and a group of people he leads them into anger and the whole mankind is being bound in bondage sin is not listening not understanding not living in the truth who are you in the lord many things can happen you have not raised up early morning to praise him to worship him to fill yourself with the truth who are you you have no time as soon as you get up you need newspaper you need the world to entertain you you need the world to know a b c d somewhere else what is happening to them that is the way the enemy builds up the world of god's children if you get up early morning daddy today the whole world needs you and you have chosen me i praise you i surrender the whole world to you i anoint the whole world empower the world bless my prime minister anoint him with your holy spirit god calls his children but the enemy is capable and he is conquering his people to tie them up on the one hand with the world tie them up with the laziness tie them up with the disturbances tie them up 
with the hurts and wounds and they are tied up some are angry why did i do this why did i marry this person why did i do this why did i all the past decisions have become your pain instead of the water is dirty when we go to god god pours the water a samaritan woman comes with an empty vessel god fills her with the vessel this is our god those who go to him they find him those who seek him they find him those who call upon him they realize they experience they are heard christian life doesn't end with the retreats christian life a retreat is a moment to make us to know who are we who is our god what is our life what we are supposed to be and where we are that's all and people who run to him they receive grace that's why do not be annoyed with evil people not envious of wrong doers they are plenty through them the enemy will tie you we read in the gospel of mark chapter 5 we read who is a christian amidst all the struggle and pain what will happen to you who are you what is your life is all about verse 21 chapter 5 then jesus crossed to the other side of the lake and while he was still on the shore he just on the shore only he is not coming out why why the people says a large crowd crowd gathered around him the large crowd is gathered around him he has just come to the shore but he is not coming out of the boat why because there is an official of the synagogue he is running to see jesus what happened to him his daughter is sick and everyone are waiting jesus please come please touch me jesus please come i am suffering if you are suffering why are you suffering why are you crying i am crying because i am helpless who told you are helpless yes i look at myself i am suffering i am look at in my house my children are dying i look at my family they are dying you are rocking the wrong place let the house die go to him who can light your house don't stay where you are dying when jesus came to the house when he saw people who are weeping and yelling tell he told them if you want miracle send them away throw them out of your house everyone are looking everyone are waiting when will jesus come and see me how beautiful i am i have put a lipstick and come and when will jesus see me or i am dressed well will jesus come and touch me today i am going to meet jesus so i will go with a nice dress with a good scent at least he will come near me hundreds of people are decorating their homes with a lot of candles and agarbattis and so many things and here is a man in the home the child is dying but he knew staying with the problem you never reach solution if you want a solution you have to go to the solution if you are thirsty you have to go to the river you have to go where the water is there don't stay where you are struggling don't die where the world is dying don't tie up with that that is dying here jesus the whole crowd is waiting for him 
but jesus is waiting for somebody who is waiting for him who is coming to meet him as soon as jesus saw the man thousands of people are there they are all waiting you may be thousand in number those who wait they will wait only those who want to meet the master those who want to touch the master those who want to embrace the master those who want to give themselves to the master they are they will go ahead and this man wanted to meet the master so he pushed the crowd he could push because rest of them are standing they are not moving go forward go forward he went forward because he went forward the bible says a large crowd gathered around him zairus an official of the synagogue came up and he saw jesus he came close from back side he has not come he is not waiting for jesus to come and touch him he says he is my god he is wonderful he is prince of peace he is my savior he has come for me and i am his and i will go and meet him he went forward he saw him those who go forward they see jesus they meet jesus the rest of them stand with their problems stand with their pain stand with their struggle stand with their wounds the child of god doesn't wait for god moves for god Cyrus he went ahead and saw the master and he came up number 1 he came up amidst all the crowd he pushed up and came up number 2 the one who came up saw jesus to third the one who saw jesus threw himself at his feet those who are waiting thousands of people they are there they might have come one hour ago to meet jesus so what you come one hour at 10 hour hour go to the church and you cry and cry and go back home empty doesn't matter he went forward he saw jesus he threw himself at his feet and begged him earnestly he began to speak speak his heart my little daughter he said the point of death will you come no you are mine come cut hold of his hands come and lay these hands on my daughter to him and going home he came forward he saw jesus he touched his feet he spoke to jesus took jesus to his home my dear friends sangam on plus tv is god's gift for you for our times like comment share and subscribe god will do wonders in your life praise the lord